But we begin with that breaking news out of North Providence where a man was found dead inside of a home on Leo Avenue. This incident prompting a hazmat response. Let's get right to 12 News reporter Matt Paddock with the breaking details. Matt? Well, Kim, in the past half hour, emergency crews clearing the scene here on Leo Avenue after North Providence Police Chief Al Ruggiero confirming to 12 News that a 44 year old Hispanic man was found dead inside of this home. Now, Ruggiero confirming that the cause of death was an overdose and says a family member out of Boston had received a call from the Dominican Republic asking them to do a wellness check. Ruggiero telling 12 News that they first arrived on scene at 420 and saw the man dead through, the, through a window and then they entered the home. After doing so, officers found a plastic bag filled with an unknown white powdery substance. That's when Ruggiero says East Providence's hazmat team was called in to test the air quality and make sure it was safe to enter. You can even see on your screens hazmat teams entering the home over the past hour. What took place just within the last half hour is the East Providence Fire Department HAZMAT team and the North Providence Fire Department DECON team made entry into the home, had contact with the foreign substance, uh, tested it, and at this time it came up negative for any foreign substance or any type of narcotics. Now, this is just a preliminary test. And police say they will not be identifying the man until mid next week. And this is still a developing story, so make sure you're sticking with 12 News, both on air and online, for the latest developments. Reporting live in North Providence, Matt Paddock, 12 News.